Hey, what's going on fellow Rangers? Welcome back to another video on Power Rangers Legacy Wars. My name is Death of Snow, and today we have the new Gold Samurai Ranger Antonio... I believe his name is Antonio Garcia. And uh, let me double check that. Yeah, there you go. Antonio Garcia from Power Rangers Samurai. So as you can see there, Lauren's right next to him. And uh, so this is officially our second Samurai Ranger in the game. So as you can see here, he has a deal which is uh, there's different rewards and different prices of crystals. It goes through 1 through 12. On the 11th purchase, you get you guaranteed two shards of him, which is pretty nice. Everything else is up to chance. You have a 26.9% to actually try to get one shard without it being the guaranteed. So you guys already know, we're here for a box opening. Uh, right now, currently, he does not have a warrior boost, but as we all know, as soon as as soon as soon uh, you go and unlock them, the warrior boost actually comes up. So here we go. We're going to see how many power crystals does it take for us to actually get the gold samurai ranger. So we're going to speed through this as fast as we can and see. Oh, there we go. Okay. We got one already, which is pretty nice. I'll take that for sure. I'll definitely take that. Uh, let's go ahead. We've got 250. As you can see there, we have about 17,000. Uh, power crystals uh, as of right now, so hopefully we don't have to use all of them to try to unlock them, which I'm pretty sure we won't. Oh, there we go. Okay, I'll take that. 26% chance? I'll take it, man. The less crystals I have to use, the better, so that way I can actually use it for the warrior boost, which would be really nice. So come on, game. Let's go. Alright, so no, no uh, shard there for him, but that's okay, though, because we got two of them. Which was really nice. There we go. We got Gold Zeal. I'll take that. Anytime, anytime, anytime you can actually get some free legendary shards, you know, definitely worth it. Come on, Morph Box. Why are you taking forever to unlock? All right. So we see there. We're just speeding through everything because um, for some reason there is like some type of lag where I'm tapping the the Morph Box and not opening. So here we go. All right, get some catch shards. That's pretty nice hole there. 500 coins. Okay. All right, come on. Let me know if you guys are actually going to go ahead and get Otonio. Uh, I I haven't I didn't make a video on him just yet because I was just busy with work. Um, I didn't get to do uh, like an early gameplay video that I normally get to do. But uh, we will be, we'll be doing a box opening here and as well as. We'll do some gameplay showing you how he is. Uh, to me, he's actually pretty decent as a character. Um, I actually really do like him. Uh, he has really good utility. Uh, he definitely needs a little bit of aid of an assist just to pull off a little bit more of his combos. Uh, but other than that, I think he's pretty solid. He definitely can handle uh, playing without an assist. Uh, all you need is, is his blue shield move. And then he can actually pick up your opponent and he can just start comboing from there. There we go. We're actually getting a lot of shards of him, which is nice. Without it without it being the guaranteed, we're actually uh, it's pretty good right now for us. We're getting some nice drop rates there. There we go. Look at that. We're about halfway there just to get him. That is really, really good. Definitely better than my average videos that I normally get. That I'll probably go through one or two rotations without actually getting him so it's pretty nice to actually see that happening so let's continue on let's keep going all right i believe this is the 10th purchase uh, this was no we're gonna go to the 11th right now and the 11th actually has a guaranteed two of them so this is the 11th one after this you'll see uh, after this morph box you'll see a guaranteed two Go ahead and speed through this. All right, nothing there. So there goes our two guaranteed shards. So we're already at seven. That's actually really nice. Oh, we got some gold zeal assist. Ten shards of gold zeal assist. I'll take that for sure. Neither though he's um he has been nerfed a little bit. Uh, his EP cost has been up to seven cost. But that's okay though because I think gold zeal definitely deserves that um a little bit of tweaking for his cost. All right, so there goes our full rotation. Our first full rotation, we actually got seven shards, which is pretty insane for me. 
Because normally it'll take me about three or four rotations to actually get uh, get him unlocked. Or not him, just, just legendary characters in general. Alright, let's go ahead and continue. After this, we'll see how many crystals we actually use. We were at 17,000. And then we'll see now. We're at 12,000. So we used about 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, about 5,000 power crystals uh, just to get 7 shards of him. So that's not too terrible of rates. So let's continue on here. All right. Can we get some more shards of him? All right. Come on, game. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. All right. Here we go. Get some more. Because I definitely want to save some crystals for uh, his warrior boost. Because to getting him to level 3 would actually be pretty nice. Alright, we're at number 9. Still no shards yet. If we could get 2 shards of him uh, before the 2 guaranteed, we'll definitely be able to unlock him by second rotation. We're going to collect our little orbs here, a little bit of money. Alright, this is number 10 out of 12. Come on, game. Alright, can we get two Antonio shards right here? Oh, no. Oh, no. Alright, there we go. 80 epic essence. That's fine, I'll take that. 2,000 coins. All right, here's our number 11. Uh, right after this one, we'll guarantee our two. Hopefully, we can get some more of him right here. Oh, man, come on. So, there goes two. We're at nine. So, we actually need just one more. Wow. So, all we need is just one shard. One little shard of him. <laughs> One little shard game. Come on. Give us it right here. Number 12. We'll get that one shard that we need. Just that one. Oh, no. All right. So it's making us go back to number three rotation. All right. Let's continue. Oh, no. Alright, we're going to continue on collecting here. This is number... Number three. Well, this is the second... Uh, third rotation. The second purchase. And also, you can see here, his assist is not here as well. Uh, you have to actually unlock the character. And uh, he will. the assist will be in the Warrior Boost uh, section. Uh, come on, don't let us go all the way up to number 11. Don't do this to us. No! Don't do it to us! We're at 9,000 power crystals, so we we around about 8,000 power crystals that we use so far to actually try to unlock this guy. So we're going to continue on. There we go! Alright, I'll take it. I will take it. We're at number... Alright, where was it at? Oh, wow, his deal actually completely left. So, now we actually hit the Warrior Boost deal. As you can see here, uh, his assist is now available as well. Uh, I think we should have enough Power Crystals. 9,200 Power Crystals. I think that's, that's more than enough to actually get the Warrior Boost. Uh, because I definitely want to unlock his assist as well. Playing that free shard. There we go. There goes his assist. Uh, normally, I definitely like to at least unlock the assist. So that way we have it for some gameplay. Also, I think the rates go up as well. Uh, we can actually check the rates up uh, for here. So before it was at 26.8, I think. Now it's at 41.8. So actually, the percentage went up normally, but I think they actually lowered the percentage from last time. Because if we check the last legendary, which I think was like, man, I forgot what, what was the last legendary. But uh, we can actually see what the rates are if you actually look back. I believe it was uh, Bison and Akuma. 
<clears throat> so if you actually look at those videos last time, I think the percentage is actually down. I believe it used to be, I don't know, like 70%. I think it was like 70, 80% um, for Warrior Boost. So that's very interesting. Alright, let's continue on. I think we should have enough to unlock the assist. Alright, let's see how many shards we're going to get of Otonio. Alright, we got one of the uh, assist there. One for the leader, almost at level 2. Just, to, uh, just about to unlock the assist as well. Let's continue moving forward. There we go, so his assist is fully unlocked. Let me see, we're at number 7, right? We're at number 7. Warrior boost is only at number 12. Man, number 12. Alright, so you know what? What we'll do is, we won't fully go there, because I don't know how many shards it might take. So let's go ahead and unlock Antonio. And just do some gameplay here. Uh, talents. Yeah, we'll, we'll boost them up for talent tree. Actually, no, because we're going to do warrior boost. So that'll credit me later on. Um, here. Uh, let's go ahead and unlock the assist. So what we'll do is, we're not going to level them up. So we're going to be at an extreme disadvantage, but that's okay. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and throw him out. There, we're going to use a movie Zack Assist just to give us the HP because we're going to need it. And then we're actually going to use Antonio to sign him. Look at our health. Our health is at 4,800. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're going to do some PvP battles. Uh, probably going to play maybe uh, three games. I'll use his assist for the first game uh, because his assist is not going to help us really good. It's not going to help us too much in the latter because he's not leveled up like at all. As you can see there, we're under 5,000 HP, so yeah. So we're definitely going to probably get bodied here for at least this one round. And hopefully next round we should do okay. <laughs> Look how much damage we're not even doing to him. Look at that. Nice. Nice backflip. <laughs> Look at the damage. <laughs> Uppercut. There we go. Alright. So we didn't even show off his assist. <laughs> Alright. So there goes his losing, his losing animation is, is actually pretty hysterical. I'm not going to lie. That's actually pretty hysterical. I want to see what his assist looks like. And then we'll go ahead and we'll switch out his assist. Put Kimberly in so we can have a little bit more HP and a little bit more uh, damage uh, to us. <clears throat> like I said, I am not going to win these ma matches. We are in a complete disadvantage. Uh, pretty much anybody who's in my predicament right now will pretty much lose in this scenario. That's actually a pretty cool assist. Um, it's, it's, it's okay. It's not too bad. Wow, it actually causes a stagger on first hit? Really? I actually want to see that again. Is this called a stagger? Oh, yes, it does. I actually like that. That's actually pretty cool. That assist will definitely see some play for sure. Stagger on first hit, then they get a projectile on the second one. I actually like that. <coughs> All right, let's go ahead and switch out Antonio assist for Kimberly. So we were at 4,800. Now we're at 6,800. That's okay. Like I said, we're not going to... I'm not expecting any type of great gameplay here, especially on ladder. Because we, uh, you know, there's, you know, you have to level up your characters. If you don't have level up your characters um, in ladder mode, especially how high I am, you're just going to get bodied. So, it's cool. Let's see if we can try to get one W here. Versus Nick. Oh my goodness, that is terrible. Oh, can he hit that? So he has like no energy.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Look at that. Nice damage. Oh. Alright, so I think that's going to be pretty much it for today's uh, gameplay of Antonio. Um, to me, I like him. He's a really good character. Obviously, you're not going to see no top tier gameplay. Uh, he's level 1. Like, I'm, I'm using him level 1, no talents. I put two talents there. Uh, no orb investment, so he's not going to hit hard at all. Uh, but to me, I personally, I like the character. Really, really strong. Love the art, uh, love the character model. Um, definitely play, uh, definitely 100% for sure, like in the show. And I really do love that new, uh, Marks, uh, that Mar Marks of Light ability. Uh, pretty, pretty cool. Until then, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video on Power Rangers Legacy Wars. Once a ranger, always a ranger. Let me know if you guys got Antonio, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.